shouldn't be going in blind. We should already have that information here. We have something like uh, 30 expatriates and uh, 350 Algerians. The main HSC concern is that uh, nobody gets hurt uh, and that uh, everyone goes back home the same way he came. And the problem, of course, is keeping that many people fed and comfortable and warm and dry and just getting water supply, food supply, it's quite remote. We've got a truck the water 250 kilometers, 120 of which is across a really rough desert track. And a truck can make a round trip in a day, if you're lucky. Anything can go wrong here, from the uh, electricity supply, we can have disk problem, data problem, anything. And we, we are here to try to solve them on a real-time basis. It's a three-year license, so we've got to get moving as fast as we can. Uh, we've got to get a system that we, we think will be reliable and will let us get adequate production so that we can get the data acquired, processed, uh, out to the interpreters and some locations for drilling worked up in time before we had to start talking about relinquishing. In 2005, BP was awarded the exploration rights for three vast blocks south of the Inaminas gas field in the Algerian Sahara. This is punishing terrain. The exploration license stipulates that six wells must be planned and drilled in only three years.